This is Kay from ClosetKeepsakes.com coming to you with a trendy thrift video. Um, so today what I wanted to talk about was, um, actually I wanted to do a haul, but it's not going to, it's a thrift haul, but it's going to be a haul on a new location that I came up on some items, some thrift items that I really like. It's going to be out of my granny's closet. So granny is in the process of downsizing and cleaning out a lot of items. So, um, I was fortunate enough to come up on some items that I do personally like. She got rid of a lot of other stuff. And of course, there's more granddaughters in the family than just me. So of course, you have to share. And everything didn't fit or wouldn't fit me or whatever. But I did come up on quite a few um, items, especially accessories. Um, I don't know how I'm going to put all these accessories together and whatnot. But I was really excited to get a number of the items that I received. So I'm going to go ahead and get right in. Um, the first thing I got was this medallion like necklace and it has the green in the middle and at the time that um, she gave it to me I was looking for more green accessories in my um, closet. I have quite a few earrings but I don't have a lot of um, necklaces so I really like this. I like the kind of gold lacy look on here and it's kind of vintage so I really love that. I love the vintage. I got this hat as well. And this is very vintage. It's probably a little more older than me um, as far as style wise. I'm not a big hat person, but I do like to have um, some different types of hats in my closet so that if I do want to dress up or it's a sunny day or whatever's going on, I do have the option of wearing hats. I actually used one of these hats and I borrowed it from Granny at the time in one of my fashion shows. And it was, of course, a vintage look, but I really love this hat. I just love that it's kind of a clean cream or tan um, color. It has a nice little brim, and it has the feather on the side for a little flair. So I came up on that hat. I also got, actually, I had quite a few hats, even though I said I don't wear a lot of hats. I did come up on a lot of hats. I got this one, and I have no idea what in the world I'm going to wear this with, but I just love this right here, all the feathers on the side. And um, I don't know, I might end up actually using this for one of my fashion show styles, but um, I was just glad to have it uh, as an addition to my closet, it either be a part of my personal closet or part of Closet Keepsakes Closet Collection. So I came up on this hat as well. Back to the green, I got another scarf here, and it's floral, but it has clearly some green accents, it's trimmed in green. I love it. I've only worn it once so far, but I thought it would be perfect either to tie around the neck or wear around the hair. I mean, I could do a number of things for it. It's even long enough that I could wear it as a belt. So um, I'm really excited about this. I think that floral never really goes out of style, even though I think it does still have kind of a vintage look. Um, I love this scarf and I will be putting it to use very soon. I actually got a number of scarves as well. Um, this is actually not really a scarf, but more of a um, head wrap, an uh, African head wrap. And I just really um, more so fell in love with the colors. I'm not a big head wrap person as far as knowing how to do it. I always do the same basic head wrap, and usually it's in a hair transition or a ha bad hair day. Um, so I will be doing some research on how to use the head wrap um, cloth a little more efficiently. But I just love the pastel kind of peach color. I think it's perfect for the spring. I could wear it in the summer or fall as well. And it has the embroidery on there, which I really love as well. It's really authentic. Got another scarf slash head wrap. This one is not the same material as the other one. But it's um, gold and red. And it has this fun pattern on it. So I thought this would be perfect, especially for, like I said, a head wrap more so. And it's... Christmas color, so I could definitely wear it in the winter time, but it doesn't have to um, just remain in the winter. I could wear it um, in the summer as well around my head or maybe even as a belt or something like that. Um, I got this little purse as well and it has the gold chain um, handle on it, which I love. I think that it was, it's perfect for either like happy hour or I could just, you know, wrap it around and go places with it. Uh, what I did not like so much about it, I love the um, suede brown suede, but I don't necessarily like the pattern on the front. But, I mean, I feel like I could work with it. Um, it's not a huge deal. Um, it's very similar to another purse that I have, um, a Chanel purse. Um, 
but it has the um, quilting on it. But um, that's this purse reminded me of that, and I thought, hey, why not get an additional one to add to my closet collection? So I also got these gloves, which I think are really great, black leather gloves. Um, they have the little accent buttons right here, and of course, it's too warm for these right now. But um, I really like them, especially because they're a little bit longer than gloves normally are, which is perfect because you know how like sometimes you get that gap right there in between your jacket and your glove? So I thought these were great. They're a little longer, so you could always um, get your full wrist coverage. So I thought those are great as well. So I know I said I don't really like hats, but I did get a whole bunch of hats from Granny. Um, I got a number of these. Um, these are sequin beanies. So I got, I think, four or five of these. I got it in turquoise, got a multicolored one. I got a black one, which can go with a number of things, of course. I got a red one, and I got a gold one. And I have been waiting for her to let these go for a minute. Um, I typically try to borrow these for fashion shows as well, but now they're mine, so I'm very excited. I was very excited about these. When she was getting rid of these, and she had them like out just to like, get rid of them, I was like, wait a minute, I'm going to need that. So I definitely got the whole stack, and I'm very um, happy about this um, come up, closet come up. So um, I was excited about the beanies. I also got a red purse. Um, red leather purse. Um, it's vintage as well. Of course, most of the things I got out of Granny's closet is vintage. It has the little snaps. It snaps and it has one pocket on the inside. Nothing big or fancy, but I need another red bag in my um, closet. And this is um, actually big enough to hold all the junk I carry in my purses. So I really like that. And the last thing I'm going to show you, actually, I have the two things. Um, I got this skirt. And I am probably going to have to get it taken in a little bit. Even though it's a medium, it's a little too big for me. Um, I really like this skirt because it reminds me of the current trend of the African um, ethnic print uh, maxi dresses. So it's very similar, um, except for it does have the elastic waist. But I'm probably going to, like I said, get this part altered. Um, and it's because I'm short, really long on me. So I can actually do a faux ethnic uh, maxi so I'm very excited about this skirt as well I love the pattern I love the colors I think it's perfect for um, the summer months so I will be rocking this very soon and the last thing I'm going to show you is another piece of jewelry of course another medallion I got this from um, granny's closet as well with the gold chain gold backing and the orange front I don't know what this is supposed to be a symbol of but I just thought it was different and unique and I was drawn to it. So I was very excited to get this as well. Um, that is all I got from my granny's closet haul. I'm very excited about all my items. I'm getting ready to put them to good use. And then hopefully I'll be able to pass it along to another cousin or... I don't have a daughter, so a cousin or an in-law or something so that they can get use out of it as well. So thank you for watching. Um, check out closetkeepsakes.com for more Trinity Thrift tips and ideas. All right, have a good one. Bye.